out here on Poison Spider, baby. Epic 4x4 adventures. That baby is a work of art. How about those Mickey T's? Rear steer, of course. Let's do this. Have all you guys been on the trip before? I have. Not this one.
by four adventures so we are out here my first time in this beast now you guys know i am a side-by-side -side guy at heart i have been here roaming the trails of moab since the rhino days and I'll tell you what, I've never been in a buggy like this before. And I know there's no other buggies like this None. one. But we are out on Poison Spider. We're at Little Arch. And I'm going to have Joe tell you a little bit about the machine. So how long has this buggy been in the brain? Uh, it's been about two years from concept to what you see it now. And when you decided you wanted to do this, what, what was the motivating factor behind that? Well, when we decided, my wife and I decided to get into this touring business, we looked around and we thought, what would be unique and different? Jeeps, Hummers, side by side. They're everywhere. They're it's, everywhere. Yeah. So let's build a buggy, but let's not build any buggy. Let's build a mega buggy. And that's kind of what we did. You know, it's just a big, fun beast of a machine. So basically, when you came up with this concept, you decided to build it. And who built it? My wife and I built this thing. That with, is crazy. With a little helper. That's it. So tell us a little bit about your history and how you were able to build such a beast. Uh, 30 years of uh, automotive design engineering is probably how I did it. My parents, it started when I was a little kid, <laughs> and they sent me to school. Now, I, I've, I've done this for a long, long time in Southern California, and then we moved out here and did a few other things. And then one day we kind of came up with this concept. I was retired. And then we decided, let's just build a buggy. So I came out of retirement and pretty much two years of working full time, day and night to get her done. That's awesome. And we're building a couple of them. This is the little one. There's a bigger the one coming one? out. little one? Uh, what? <laughs> yeah, there's a bigger one coming out. This is a six passenger. That's uh, five plus a driver. And then we're going to do a nine passenger, which is eight plus a driver. That's awesome. Yeah. So people can call you, go to your website, and you're actually going to take customers yep. out we, and have an epic adventure. Absolutely. It's just like any other tour company, except it's completely different. So, <laughs> you know, yeah, we sell seats or depending on the trail, we'll sell the whole machine. The harder the trail, the steeper the price until we just sell the machine. That gotcha. way, if you want to come out by yourself, or with the group, it's the machine. A, a trail like this, it's per seat. You awesome. Know? So we do different things, but mostly, mostly we cater. But sunsets are usually up here on Poison Spider. Awesome. So some features of the of the machine. Tell us a little bit about the motor, the drivetrain, rear steer. We, yeah. I mean, who doesn't love rear steer? Who doesn't if love? If you it? have never been in something with rear steer, you've got to check this thing out. It is so cool to be going what 45 degrees down the trail. And this thing turns on a dime. And the tires are how big? 54 inch Mickey Thompson's. That's huge. Yeah. So the motor. The motor is an LSX 454 crate motor. Um, it's pretty much right out of the crate. We did a little bit of cam timing, uh, fuel injection system, and of course we built the tuned headers for it. That's so crazy. So another part of your business and how I actually know you is from the side-by-side -side world. Absolutely. Uh, so tell us a little bit about the side-by-side -side scene in Epic 4x4 Adventures. Well, we decided to get into, we needed some U drives. We needed something that the customer could drive. Obviously, the insurance company said no to letting people drive our big ones. Dang, buddies. I, I want to drive this thing so bad. <laughs> but uh, so we looked around we said, let's get into the side-by-side -side world. And truthfully, for Mob Utah, uh, Kawasaki answered our prayers. KRX 1000s, um, we, we bought them from this gentleman right here. And of course, as you can tell, we, we just don't leave anything alone. We customized them, roll cages, roofs, six-point harnesses, bumpers, nerf bars, 35-inch tires. And that's kind of how we became friends. So these KRXs, you guys, you can actually drive these. Now, yep. Joe is awesome. He knows these trails very well. And when you take people out on the you drive tours, how does that work? Well, basically, they, they, they rent a machine from us. We supply them a, a professional guide. And we pretty much will take you anywhere you want to go, including Moab Rim, some of the other harder trails, or we'll go up to Fins and Things and play all day. Um, and we really encourage people to get out and use the machines. They're rock crawling phenomenons, and we want people to rock crawl with them. And so we take them to where the rocks are. Sure, we do some some sand sliding and things like that, but rock crawling is what we're all about here. Awesome. So where can people find more information about what you do? Uh, the best way to do it is just go on go online, epic4x4adventures.com, uh, and all of our information is there. 
and you will be able to get to us. That's really the best way to do it. Awesome. All right, guys, we are here live. It's the 18th of May. Look at that sunset. Moab is where it's at. Right now is the perfect time of year to get out and enjoy the Red Rock. And what better way than in this beast or in a KRX 1000? Joe, my pleasure. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Hit them up, you guys. We'll be sure and post up a link to their website as well as some information about their company and how you can contact them. And as always, have a great day, everybody. Peace.